registered dental hygienist in Washington State. Uh, I chose to become a hygienist when I graduated high school in 2010. I came from a heavily uh, STEM background family, so science was something that was familiar to me. Um, I had actually moved my senior year of high school from New Mexico to Washington and did not necessarily know exactly what I was going to do. And I took actually a career assessment test that matched me with my personality and careers. One of them being dentistry, the other being engineering. Um, and engineering is not, was not my forte. Uh, it happens in Washington that there's only one bachelor's degree program for dental hygienists and that's at Eastern Washington University. It's just outside of Spokane. We are located close to Coeur d'Alene, Idaho, um, would be the largest landmark. We're about four hours from Seattle. So I applied to go to Eastern. I got in. My track was two years of prereqs out at the main campus and then three years in the dental hygiene program on the health science campus. So a typical day for me as a hygienist looked like getting up at about five in the morning, I'd go to the gym just because that was the time I could go. I'd come home, eat breakfast, head to work, typically be at work around 6, 20, 6 30. Morning meeting where we go through our day as a team would be about 6.45 to 7 with our first patient starting at 7 a.m. Then typically you're scheduled every hour on the hour for routine hygiene appointments. So healthy patients, um, people that you see every six months. If we had a new patient, we had two hours, um, and that included a full patient assessment workup, which is full mouth x-rays, dental charting, perio charting, which perio charting is, the, uh, is where we assess your health by measuring the gums. One thing we know from hygiene and dentistry in general is that oral health actually ends up affecting systemic health. So that kind of is my, my big um, focus for being a hygienist. Um, so I chose to actually end up going back to school and getting my master's. So my master's is in dental hygiene as well. I received it also from Eastern. And my goal for that is to start integrating healthcare professions together to better patient outcomes. So my end goal as a hygienist is actually to get out of the clinical operatory and work more um, on oral systemic health and education. Um, so for anyone who is interested in dentistry, the potential to go outside of the operatory uh, is vast. Um, not many people do it. It is becoming a newer route for hygienists. So anyone who is interested in clinical or beyond clinical, dental hygiene is becoming um, an opportunity to do something different 